Glock 19X. You already know everything that come in the box. The extra clips. And all that. The cleaners and all that. What I did like about the 19X, the first thing I seen, you know, it come with three clips. The regular standard clip, the flesh clip, and it come with two of these with the plus two on the bottom. So it come with your regular clip, your standard clip with the flesh fit, but it also come with a 17 plus two. It come with two of these. Two of the plus twos. It's hard. So you can rock it with your flesh look with the standard clip like this. Or you can rock it with the plus two on the and it look like this. I'm rocking the plus two just out the strength. Cause they come with 17 in the standard magazine plus two they're 19 plus one in the head they're 20. so you know you can walk around with 20 shots on you in your regular regular clip so i'm gonna rock the plus one it is empty nothing in my slide or in my magazine Glock 19X. I did already. Um, just throw my uh my beam. It's a green beam that I had on another one of my guns. I just went ahead and threw that on here. But I will begin an O light in the future. I just ain't uh ordered it yet. But I am gonna get an O light to go on here with a green beam as well. I did also go get me a 33 round magazine as well for that tan, tan magazine, 33 round for the Glock, but uh, everybody know what a 19X is, the Glock 19X is the 19 slide with the 17 frame. So you get the best of both worlds. You get the 19, the size of the 19 for the length wise. And then you get the 17 slide for the length wise because on that 17, on the Glock 17, you get 17 shots in the standard magazine. And in the 19, you get 15 shots in the standard magazine. So on here, you get the 19 slide with the 17 handle grip. And I think that's perfect because I want to tote 17 in my oil, my normal clip. But I like the size of the 19 as well. So I'm getting the size of the 19 for the link. And I'm also being able to tote 17 rounds. So it's perfect. You know what I'm saying? This, and I feel like the 45, I think it's the 45. Because on the 45, you can tote, I think you can tote um, 17 in, the, in your normal clip as well with the 19 size link so i feel like them two might be the t one of the top best glocks as well but um what i do want to say about this gun i tried to put the beaver tail on her but i couldn't i tried to search the video to show me how to do it but i couldn't find no video and if you know drop down in the comments let me know how you put the beaver tail on her? Cause I or uh, I want the beaver tail on mine. I like how it poke out right here with the beaver tail. Little, it'll, it'll be longer and it'll poke all the way out right here. So like after you do like a mag dump or uh, uh, just go to the range and shoot it or whatever you do with it. When the slide pop back, showing it empty, it won't catch your finger. Cause normally when I hold it like this and I'm shooting, it can catch my thumb. But with that beaver tail right here, it'll stick out so far that my thumb will be sitting under it right here. So I like the beaver tails better, me personally. You know what I'm saying? So I I, I would want to put that on though. Then um, basically, the Glock 19X 
you already know what it is. It don't it don't come with them plastic sights on it. It come with some actually some good sights on it, and they glow in the dark. They neon green and they glow in the dark in a normal sight. So you ain't gotta go buy no buy no sights for the nineteen X. It already come with the with the sights on it. So I like that part too. Overall, man, this this a great gun. The trigger ain't too horrible on it. I like the trigger on it. And y'all, I already shot it. But um it's pressure. I do got uh, some self-defense rounds and uh I don't walk around with nothing but self-defense rounds or critical rounds. Never practice rounds on my gun unless I'm finna go to the range or I'm finna go to the country and I'm finna shoot some. Shoot a target or something like that. But um you will catch me at all time with the self-defense rounds or some critical rounds up in here. Um, I ain't gonna do too much talking about that gun. You pretty pretty much I already know what it is. Like I said, I just threw a green beam on it for now till I order my light. I'm rocking the oil uh, plus two on my clip. So I got 19 right now in the clip and I throw one in the head. There's 20 rounds on me at all times. I love the color of this gun. It's like a peanut butter. I forgot what they call it. A FD, a FDE, FDC, or some whatever they call it. The color. But um, I love the gun, man. Uh, definitely top one of my top five Glocks. Definitely one of my top five Glocks. You can not take this off as well. I did see a video. Saying you can take this off. I don't see no point of taking it off. So I'm going to leave it on a. Uh, throw me a 50 round on here. And the O-Light. And it's good to go. That's all I'm going to do to it. No other attachments will be added. You're gonna, I'm going to rock it just like this. Glock 19X. 9mm. Green bean. Nothing in the head, I already showed y'all that. Just in case, I know how y'all be in the comments. 33 round. Green bean, 33 round. Yes, sir. I do, uh, I'm wrapping it, as I'm wrapping the video up, I do wanna, um, get into my next video that I will be dropping. I also got, um, Something new I want to talk about. And I want to show y'all real quick before I close this video out. I do got a new gun I want to show y'all. And I want y'all, I'm going to do a review on it. And I want y'all to hop down in the comments and tell me what y'all think about it anyway. Before I do the review, I give you a sneak peek glance at it right now. This is my Kale Tech Sub 2009 millimeter. As you can see, I already made some upgrades on it. I'm not gonna get into it right now, but this is just a little sneak peek of what my next video is gonna be about. A lot of people don't like the Kale Tech. They're probably one of my, one of my favorite guns for years. I could never uh. Get a hold to it and i finally got it i finally found one they're a reasonable price they ain't expensive at all you can find something around four something maybe 500 or something and um i got the tan one i like that better than the all black one i threw some more i'm gonna throw probably like two more attachments on it but i ain't really gonna get into that kale tech too much because that's a whole nother video next time you see the gun right here though i will have an o light on it probably the peanut butter o light to match it and that'll be all for real for real i'm gonna get a 50 round for it but it'll be all and i'm gonna do a video shooting it then y'all know how i perform but y'all already know all this it's a glock the top of the line like subscribe and hop in the comments and uh let me know what you think about my 19x
or what you think I should do to it. Don't forget to tell me or how to put that beaver tail on there. Let me know what else upgrades I should do to it and what I should do to my kale tip. But kale tip video on the way. Subscribe.